This morning, people are concerned about toxic chemicals after one spilled over during a train derailment in Ohio. And that concern extends to an 11 Alive viewer who wants to know what's on trains traveling through Metro Atlanta. She reached out to our Verify team. Jerry Carnes is in downtown Atlanta. Jerry, you've got some answers for us. Well, good morning. We're in an area of downtown Atlanta near State Farm Arena overlooking a series of railroad tracks. Atlanta's very foundation is the rail system. Every day, thousands of rail cars pass through the city. The 11 Alive viewer who reached out to us wants some reassurance about the cargo passing through Metro Atlanta. The train derailment that spilled toxic liquid in Ohio led an 11 Alive viewer to ask, are hazardous materials traveling by rail allowed through Metro Atlanta? So let's verify if there are any laws or regulations prohibiting trains from moving dangerous chemicals through heavily populated areas. Our sources are the Federal Railroad Administration, the Association of American Railroads, and attorney Gerald Felitti of the Lawfare Project, who's been involved in litigation concerning railroad companies and hazardous spills. According to the Association of American Railroads, more than two million carloads of hazardous materials travel along our nation's rail system each year. Federal law states that rail carriers use routes that pose the least overall safety and security risk when transporting hazardous materials. Rail carriers are required to route their trains in a way that minimizes the possibility of problems. And that risk assessment takes into account, for example, the size of the population center, the type of material that's being transported, the ability to respond by local or federal authorities if there is an issue. The Federal Railroad Administration oversees the process and can recommend a rail carrier change its route depending on the risk, but Felitti points out there's nothing in the law that prohibits hazardous chemicals moving through major cities. Cities like Atlanta can request a list of hazardous materials traveling through their area. The Federal Railroad Administration says that information is for the express purpose of helping responders plan and prepare for any emergency. So the mayor of Atlanta can ask from any railroad company that passes through, what are you transporting? But that doesn't mean that we can stop it. So we can verify that no, there are no federal laws that prohibit rail carriers from transporting hazardous materials through heavily populated areas like Metro Atlanta. Any rail car that is carrying hazardous materials has to have a placard indicating that's the case. The Association of American Railroads insists that 99.9% .9 of the trains carrying hazardous materials reach their destinations without an issue. Back to you.